Hello everyone, this is Al coming to you once again for Kindred Souls of Brooklyn. And today we find ourselves at Greenwood Cemetery, the third largest cemetery in the world, and in Brooklyn, right here in the heart of Brooklyn. Now, they do a lot of tours in here. They're very welcoming in here. They give you out a map, and this will help you find your way around. Like I said, this is a very large cemetery. This particular entrance today is closed. It's the one on Fort Hamilton. But the main entrance is 36th Street and 5th Avenue. So today, folks, we're here for a special reason. We are here to see one of the giants of the silver screen, Mr. Frank Morgan. And what person out there hasn't seen The Wizard of Oz? So we're going to go today. We're going to follow. This isn't a yellow brick road, but we're going to follow this road. Like I say, folks, you come into Greenwood Cemetery. They're very welcoming. You get that map. And Mr. Frank Morgan is number 20 on the map. There's a lot of famous people buried here. So you're going to look for number 20 on the map. But this is the outer border of uh, Greenwood Cemetery. And I say it's very large, but you're right off the street. So what you're going to do is when you come in from the uh, either entrance, you're going to go along and you're going to come to um, Border, uh, this is Border Avenue right now. And what you're going to do is make a right over here. This is Grape Avenue, as you can see. You got Grape Avenue. And you're gonna look for the Wupperman plot. And the Wupperman plot, Frank Morgan's name was Wupperman. And I guess for professional reasons or entertainment reasons, he turned around and he changed it to Morgan. But he never lost sight of his heritage. So of course, when he was, he, he died, of course, he wanted to be here in his family plot. So he's in the Wupperman plot, but he's got Frank Morgan on his on his tombstone. So pardon the little bumps here. I'm going to get out of the car in a second. I just wanted to show you guys how you come up on it. Show you that it's really easy to find. And uh, we're going to go a little farther up here. As you're going to see. Okay, here we are. Pardon me, I'm just gonna get out of the car for a second here so you guys can take a look at it. So just a little bit about the cemetery. As I say, folks, this is an amazingly beautiful cemetery. I would say the prettiest one in the entire world. Um, this cemetery dates back to 1800. I think it's 1838 when the cemetery actually was formulated. And uh, with no further ado, we're gonna go now over to the grave of Mr. Frank Morgan. Now, right here, this is Frank Morgan's son, George Morgan, son of Alma and Frank Morgan. And then over here, I'm gonna show you his parents' grave. There you see Adolf Edward, Virginia Flora Joy, Flora Stafford, wife of Adolf and Edward. These were his parents, and I guess other relatives. But right here, we have the famous grave site of Mr. Frank Morgan. See, it's got Wupperman on the grave there. And he was born in 1890, and he passed away in 1949. And of course, The Wizard of Oz movie was made in 1939. Again, how many people have seen that movie and be loved and amazing. He played seven different roles in that movie. So now, as you can see, a lot of people come to see Frank Morgan. I'm gonna zoom in on that. So you can see it's Frank Morgan, The Wizard of Oz. MGM character actor, he must be over the rainbow. And as per tradition, you know, for good luck, for blessing, a lot of people leave change, they leave rocks on there, just as like a tribute. And uh, I say again, folks, you know, you can come in here as long as you're respectful. They're very accommodating. I say, I mean, what cemetery do you go in? I mean, I guess there's some, but that has such a nice map. So like I say, you could come in here and there's just so many famous people in here. And I have a couple other videos on the cemetery if you're interested, but I wanted to just do this one on Frank Morgan because he's such an icon. I mean, as I say, what person hasn't seen The Wizard of Oz? There's so many different things that, so many different catchphrases, so many different um, things that we think of when we think of The Wizard of Oz. And uh, this is the man himself. This is the wizard. This is the guy who they all went to see. You know, the lion got his courage and the tin man got his heart. The scarecrow got his brain. Dorothy went there to go back home. And they went and they found uh, a wizard. 
who had his human flaws, but was all the same, the wizard. So folks, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Um, please subscribe. If you have any questions or anything, drop me a line. You can connect, you can connect with me at uh, connection at kindredsoulsofbrooklyn.com if you want to email me. But as I say, folks, give me a like, subscribe, come on out to the cemetery. There's so many other famous things to see. It's just a wonderful place. I mean, people come here to eat lunch. People come here for bird watching. It's such, such a huge cemetery that you just, it's, you'd have to see it to believe it. So, uh, as I say, you're not going to get lost. They're very accommodating here. There's people walking around, you know, in terms of workers, a lot of things going on. The landscaping is beautiful. So, uh, once again, the grave of Frank Morgan, the famous Frank Morgan, the Wizard of Oz. And uh, he's over the rainbow. All right, folks, thank you. Have a wonderful day. Hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you real soon. Thank you.